the position of E minor on the cuatro, making use of three fingers. It may seem a little bit difficult, but because all the fingers are together and it's it's kind of forming with the natural uh, figures or the the natural way in which the fingers move, so it's it's not all too complicated to mark. This is E minor in its first position. If we were to apply this and move, slide it down using the same theory, so we would, for example, if we were to search for a G minor in another position, then we would simply make use of those fingers, or those uh, positioning of the fingers using the figure of E minor, sliding it down until we find the corresponding chord. So we'll start off by moving it from E minor to F minor, and the distance between those two is simply one half tone. So we'll slide it down by one half tone. Here's our F minor chord. And between F and G we have two half tones. So we'll slide it over. And there's our G minor.